If you don't feel like someone's squeezing your lungs at the end of a run, you've not worked hard enough. Same when you're training. Doesn't matter what you're training. If you're not working hard enough, you're not going to get the results. Simple as that. You see it all the time. If you look around the gym, 20, 30 people on the phone, get in the gym, do your shit and get gone. And then eat decent food. Sorry, I get a bit fucking pumped. I love this feeling. I'm gonna get some scran now. You wanna feel good about yourself? You've gotta punish yourself. Punish yourself to feel better. Sounds crazy, but it's true. It's true. You live like a slob, you feel like a slob. You live like a champion. Train like a champion. So Wednesdays are usually my longer sort of day. I'm usually in the gym until about nine o'clock, but because we're having some construction work going on, I've rearranged my sessions to tomorrow. So I've got tonight off, so I was thinking I want to do something a little bit special for my clients. So as you might know, I'm a bit of a protein ball addict. So I'm going to put a recipe together for my clients. And I'm going to film it. And then what I can do is get them to make me my protein balls. It's a true protein ball addict. The staff in Sainsbury's think I'm fucking weird. I just walk in, walk straight down the cereal aisle, straight to the bakery and just... <laughs> literally stand there and just sniffing the bakery. I love it. <laughs> Doing this uh, video um, for my clients, I've just got no time to cook, so I'm making a sausage butty. Coach Simon style. Turkey sausages, protein bread. That's what I'm saying. Sound good? Well, I'm having it. And I'm going to show you how to do it. Dead easy. Buzz off walking upstairs, mate. I wasn't going to film what I was eating tonight just because I just fancied something quick and easy but healthy at the same time. And it's nothing special. Just if you get organised and get the ingredients in, this is mega. So we're going to go with a turkey sausage and protein bread butty. Right, we need turkey sausages, you can get these in most supermarkets now. Some lettuce, we're going to make a perinase. And then protein bread, you get this off, um, you can get this off my protein or muscle food. 30 grams of protein in these two slices. That's about as much as... A chicken breast. Don't ask. Look at the state of that. Got layers of sausage. The macros in this. I was gonna, I was gonna do like a, a bit of a talk while I was eating it, but it was that good that I couldn't talk. Just stuffed it down my face. Right, protein balls now. This is dead simple. All you need is some porridge oats. Uh, some low calorie sauce or some honey, a little bit of milk, I'm using soy milk and some whey protein. I'm actually going to put about 10 grams of uh, instant coffee in there, just going to mix it up a little bit, see how that comes just want to keep mixing it all and it should start just about to stick together and then you're going to get your hands involved and make a big massive ball of it. So that's pretty much it. You just cut them into like, I've cut these more into like protein bars. They're ready to go now, you can just eat them. Or if you want them to firm out a little bit, what you can do is just chuck them in the freezer for 10 minutes and then they're good to go for about three days then in the fridge. The one thing I would say is when you're buying protein products or doing stuff like this, they say the protein bars, but actually the main macro in this is actually carb. So, Coach Simon's 
carby snacks.